Hello everybody. I just wanted to do a quick video. So I went to Walmart thinking I was going to be a better shopper this year for Christmas. And I bought my young grandchildren a bunch of clothes because my older grandchildren won't shop there, but my young ones will. So I took about mm, $300, $350 worth of clothes up to the layaway department. And I get up there and had to wait 30 minutes for somebody to finally show up that works at Walmart in the layaway department. And they said, okay, what do you want to put on layaway? I said, well, these clothes. I piled them all up on the counter. And they said, oh, you can't put clothes on layaway. Now, how much sense does that make? I said, excuse me? She says, you can't put clothes on layaway at Walmart anymore. I said, well, when did this start? Oh, it's been like that for a while. I said, now, how much sense does that make? She says, none, but it's the law. I said, what? She said, it's, it's the rules. I said, well, what's the purpose? She said, ma'am, I'm not really sure. I said, okay. Now, evidently, the only thing you can put on Walmart layaway is electronics, games, and stuff like that, toys. But you cannot put clothes. I mean, if you sell clothes, why can't you put clothes on layaway? Anyway, if anybody has the answer to that question, I'm really curious. Why can you not put clothes on layaway at Walmart? Let me know. Curious. Anyway, talk to y'all later. We've got a little bit of rain going on here. and It's supposed to be like this all week. So I've been having uh, kind of a boring day. I went and hung some blinds for an apartment earlier and uh, done for the day. So I'm over here by the school because I got to pick my grandkids up. And they get out at 3, but you have to get in line at like 1.45, 2 o'clock because the line will stretch for miles. <laughs> and I'm talking miles. <laughs> Because nobody trusts them to put their kids on the buses here. And nobody allows their kids to walk here. So, anyway. I will talk to y'all later. Love y'all. Bye.